welcome. If you're new, hi, my name is Kay. I am a zero-based cash budgeter, and on my channel, I stuff my bills, my sinking funds, as well as do some budgeting videos. So in today's video, I'm going to be cash stuffing my last paycheck of October, but first we need to do a little bit of cash exchange. So let's go ahead and get started. <laughs> off let me say hi to all my new subscribers thank you so much for joining me if you're new please definitely drop me a note down in the comments I love to see you guys down there um, so I have some extra money in this envelope that I pulled out from the bank to do a side hustle stuffing later but first we need to do our cash con uh, cash swap so I want to go ahead and get started on that before we get ready for my bill stuffing this is supposed to be $1,420. This is including my weekly pay as well as some side hustle money. So I just kind of want to make sure, they didn't ask me what kind of bills I wanted. So we're just going to make sure that it's all here and then get it organized to go ahead and do a little swap out. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, eleven hundred. 1200, 1300, 20, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1400, and 20. So, yeah, these bills were all random, but um, got a little old 100 in here. That's kind of cool. All right, so. So, I need to head on over. I'm going to hit up my credit card envelope. This is an envelope I use to do like sort of my at-home bank. This has got a lot of my unstuffings from the spending that I do throughout the month from my sinking funds categories. So we are going to, I want to go ahead and swap out these 300s with something a little nicer. I know some of you guys love these old 100s, but I do not. <laughs> I like the new colors, the new blue. So I'm gonna swap these 300, okay? So, I need a total of, let's see, 1620s. So, we have five here. So that's, let's see, that's not what I want. So that's these 200s. Let's swap out these 200s for 20s. So that's 10 20s that I need. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82. These two, these so now we have 15 20s. I'm gonna put these 200s in my bank here. All right. So now we need to swap out another 100. So I'll swap out this one. I need to get, let's see, I need 12 tens and one more 20. So let's grab another 20. Let's see if there's a better one in here. That doesn't, that doesn't look too bad. Well, let's do this one. Okay, and then, so that's 20. Twenty. 30, 40, 50, 60, 80, 90. Oh, I don't have enough 10s. 90, 100. 90, 100. So let's do this one more time. 20, 30, 40, 60, 80. No. 20, 40. No. 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90. Goodness, guys, am I messing this up? 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. All right, well, so I got my 20s taken care of. This should be 16 20s. So let's put this 100 back. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Okay. 
So the 20s are done. Now 10s, I need 12. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And I need 9 fives. 1, 2, 3, 4. So let's take out another 100. Oh, they're all pretty similar now. So let's do this one. All right. We may not be able. Let's see. So one, two, three, four, five. So I need a total of nine. So five, ten, fifteen, twenty. 25. Hmm, so that's a nine. So we will maybe leave this five in here. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. All right. That is all we can do. So we're going to have to um, swap out these 20s in another envelope. So since we're in my bills binder, let's see what we can do in All here. Right. So I let's do. see what I can do. I need some tens. So let's head on into, no, nope, utilities I don't think would have any. Let's see, Wi-Fi, let me see if Wi-Fi has any. Um, let's go ahead and swap out one ten and two fives. One, two, Three, four, five. I might go ahead and just swap out a five. For these ones. All right. Wow, here's two tens. Shmoopy Schmoop might have some. Yes, he does. All right, let's give this another quick count and see if we still have 1420 there, but we did it. All right, so now I just need to pull for my bills. So I need 600 and 100. We're gonna set this 100 off to the side for swapping. We are going to set these 250s aside for swapping. Um, let me grab my notebook here and see what other denominations I need. I have six 20s. One, two, three, four, five, six 20s. This will go to the other side. And now I need five tens. One, two, three, four, five. All right. Now I need one, two, three, four, five fives, I believe. And now I need ten ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, so six, seven, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, one, twenty. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. And then 10 ones. Hmm, I'm missing a 20. So 20. More um, cash, con uh, cash swapping. And then I need 6, 7, 8. Okay, 928 is what I need. All right, hey, so let's go ahead and get started in my wallet. Um, I spent everything in my pocket envelopes for last week and a little bit more. I went out to dinner yesterday. I didn't mean to, I, well, I meant to, it's just I didn't expect to do it, but ran out of time. And so, you know, that's what happens. You go out to eat. So um, I will go ahead and stuff my envelopes and possibly just unstuff this 
um, for this following week um, and pay myself back. Um, I charge it to the credit card, so I'll put it back in the credit card when I do my unstuffing. Um, so we have been getting so much rain that our ut my utilities went down. And so I'm gonna put extra in my groceries because I wanna go to Costco. I have some things I need to stock up on. So I think that the end of every month, it's a great way to pull maybe whatever is extra from what I didn't plan for or budget for and put it into groceries. So since bills are a little bit less, groceries is going to get $80, 20, 40, 60, 80. I'm excited about Costco. I haven't been all month. I'm ready to go. What are some of y'all's favorite things to get at Costco? Um, I When I go, I always get a huge bag of limes. I love limes and avocados. Um, and I think what else I need? What else do I need? I need some frozen vegetables and some hamburger meat. So I'm hoping that's plenty. Um, and almond milk. I need almond milk. They've got the cheapest almond milk at Costco. Um, entertainment is getting 10. Okay. Dining out is getting 40. I wanna give myself just a little extra um, since I did eat out. Um, maybe to like maybe order in a pizza and have a date night in since I already ate out with him this week. Um, gas is going to get 15 This is actually working out really well, $15 a week. I did fill up and got almost a full tank of gas last week, so I may not need this for a while. Um, miscellaneous is going to get five ones, so I'm going to pull these ones in the back. So one, two, three, four, five. This is my buffer envelope, so if I go over in any of these categories by a dollar or some change, I will use this money. All right, so pocket envelopes are stuffed. So let's go ahead and get my wallet out of here. All right, let's go ahead and head into my bills binder. Since this is the fourth week of October, um, all my bills are going to be fully funded for the month and I am a month ahead. So this is all going for November bills. Um, so mortgage gets $603, so one, two, three, four, five, six, uh, one, two, three, we'll pull from the back. All right, so now mortgage has 100, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 1,000. 100, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 2,000, 100, 200, 300, 400, so that's 2,400, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So mortgage is fully funded at 2412. All right. Now, utilities, since my utilities went down, I'm only stuffing 20 today, and we should have plenty to pay the bill for November's bills. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200. And I believe combined the bills didn't, didn't I think, it's under 200. I don't think it's under 195, but um, just shy of that, I think. So Wi-Fi gets its usual 17, so 10, 15, 16, 17. So now Wi-Fi has 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, and we actually have a little bit over. So do you guys roll over your bills when you budget, when you have a little extra, do you roll over or do you go ahead and restuff what you didn't use in maybe a different envelope or into a savings challenge? Let me know. I'm thinking about just letting my um, rollover accumulate in here because it's worked out a couple of times in the summer where I needed it because my summer bills were so high. Um, so lawn care um, is also not getting its amount I don't think it needs more than maybe 
20, 40, 60. So let's do 15 in here. All right. I believe lawn care only needs $76. So 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79. So yeah, plenty of extra. So that is taken care of for the month. The month of November actually has three lawn days. So I'm thinking about skipping one of them just so that... Um, oh, and streaming, I don't need any of this this month. So my cash rewards um, came in for my one of my credit cards and so it's paying for this bill. So we are not stuffing it today. And we are now done with my bills binder. Oh, my little avos. Stay in there, you little guys. Okay, so now we're heading into high priority. Every month I like to stuff a little extra to my mortgage principal and to save for month ahead. So each one of these is getting $50 to make it a usual $200 payment towards my principal. And I make an extra $200 principal payment online. So when I do my bills unstuffing for the month, I will make sure to get that in the bank. Same with month ahead. This actually goes to savings. I am working on getting two months ahead now. I was watching the, um, the YouTube channel, The Queen's Budget. Let me know if you know, I uh, forget her name, but um, she's actually stuffing to get a year ahead. I think that's a super, um, I don't know, super incentivizing. That would just be amazing to have a year worth of bills in the savings. So that sounds like something I'm planning for because I don't want to get rid of this envelope. I love being able to save $200 just with my paycheck. So we're going to continue to do that. Um, are any of you guys saving for a year? Let me know in the comments. All right, and I think Schmoopy is the last envelope in this binder that I need to stuff. And Schmoopy is getting 10. So now Schmoopy has 20, 40, 60, 80, 90. Um, I had a new subscriber ask me what Schmoopy is. So for all you new folks, Schmoopy is actually my um, significant other. His name is Justin. I don't think I've ever mentioned his name before on my channel, but we have pet names for each other. We wake up every morning and we text each other a sweet little good morning with a new pet name. Um, and so it's been sort of our tradition since the day we met to have pet names for one another. And so there's a Seinfeld episode um, about pet names, really funny. Justin loves Seinfeld. And so Schmoopy is in the Seinfeld episode and it has just been um, super cute between us. And so that is his envelope because he's my Schmoopy. Um, but yeah, I think the Seinfeld episode was like, everyone was so disgusted with the pet names because they were being so cute. It was disgusting. <laughs> so yeah, we're kind of disgusting. All right, so I have a little bit left here. Um, I do want to stuff this money in, this last two fives in home care. So I have a little bit of uh, IOU, but we're gonna do that in another video, maybe in my monthly on stuffing. So $10 is going into home care, and home care has 200 in the bank, 20, 40, 5, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 254. I don't have any plans for this money, but I did head on to T, um, is it Timu? Yeah, I went to Timu, you guys. And I made myself an account and I found some really great deals. I swear, I think I got like four things and it was only like $8. <laughs> so I'm super excited about Timu. And that is it for this binder. I do have, uh, let's see, $3. So we're just going to head on over to my October dollar savings challenge. Color in, oh, well, here's a $3 challenge since that's still open. And we're going to go ahead and put these last three dollars in here. And let me get my little markers to color in. Hold over. So in my three dollar mini savings challenge, I have 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Beautiful. All right, 
So that is all I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. If you have any questions for me down below, please feel free to ask. I haven't done a, um, I don't know, what is it, like 40 questions uh, video yet. So if y'all are interested in something like that, I find those really, really fun. And um, if anyone is interested in getting to know me better, I'd be happy to do one of those during one of my cash stuffing videos. But for now, Thank you so much for hanging out. And if you haven't yet, please go ahead and subscribe. If you've made it this far, please leave me an avocado in the comments. And I will see you guys on the next video. Bye for now.